A furious royal commentator has blasted Prince Harry and Meghan Markle and said they should be stripped of their titles after Meghan gave a controversial interview to a US magazine. In an interview with The Cut, the Duchess made several unflattering comments about her old life as a working member of the family. These included that she would have been prevented from dropping her kids to school and accusing the British media of calling, the, children the N-word with no evidence. In response, prominent critic of the couple, Alison Pearson wrote in The Telegraph that Meghan's grievances grow ever bolder and more extravagant, floating free of any observable reality. Commenting on the couple's return to the UK next week, she said, in effect, we have a quasi-royal tour with the couple now snubbing, or being snubbed by? The very institution from which they derive their power and celebrity. It's bizarre. And damaging to the monarchy. Clearly, it's time the Sussexes lost their royal titles whose privileges they enjoy without the accompanying responsibilities and restraints. Harry and Meghan will return to the UK together next week for the first time since the Queen's Platinum Jubilee in June. The couple will first attend the One Young World 2022 Summit in Manchester on September 5th. They will then attend the Well Child Awards 2022 on September 8th. The high-profile charity event shines the spotlight on some of the UK's seriously ill children and young people, as well as those that care for them. Prince Harry has worked with the charity for some years as a patron to spread awareness and encourage people to participate in nominations. Prince Harry's wife Meghan Markle has threatened that she has more secrets to share about the royal family in the future, according to a royal expert. Meghan made more claims about her time as a senior royal in new interview. But the Daily Mail's royal editor Richard Eden, believes the Duchess of Sussex could have more to say. Eden said, she made a series of very unsubtle hints that she could say a lot more in the future. It seemed to be clear that they were threats. She was coming across as saying, I can say these things, I've chosen not to. The Duchess of Sussex revealed for the first time that she kept a daily journey before she stepped away from royal life with Prince Harry, sparking fears she has more to tell. Meghan Markle is receiving flack for driving everybody nuts with her antics. The Duchess of Sussex is called out for her shocking move by Princess Diana's designer in a fresh confession. Speaking to GB News, David Emmanuel said, We've got Prince William who's doing a splendid job and we've got Harry Windsor in America with an American woman who is driving everybody nuts. Emmanuel added that Meghan had messed up her own family, now she's over here trying to mess up the royal family. It's shocking, he concluded. When asked if Diana has approved of Megxit, Emmanuel confessed, I think she would be deeply shocked, the designer said. I think if she was alive it wouldn't have happened with the two brothers. She wouldn't have allowed it. She'd have smoothed the waters, he concluded. Meghan moans about her life as a Hollywood trophy wife. Like any good fairy tale, the princess scored her happy ending, purchasing the $14 million Montecito mansion shortly before she and Harry excoriated the Queen, her dying husband, and the Prince of Wales in an Oprah interview blasted across the world. Wales in an Oprah